I have to do a shout out for Sean. Let's do that first. Ladies and gentlemen, it's time for another Grap Rang and Top 10 list. <laughs> Today's list Top 10 ways to stop a Huang push. Number 10, use flares to distract him from how badly he's beating you. Number 9, <laughs> don't move. His eyesight is based on movement. <laughs> Number 8, delete starting TC and rebuild it next to his. Can we douche him? Number 7, fight Manganels with villagers. It won't stop him. <laughs> some point. True. Number True. six, build a moat oh, okay. around your town and fill it with crocodiles. Number five, pause the game right before every Manganel shot lands. <laughs> Number four, I'd say to Huang him back, but two Huangs don't make a right. <laughs> <laughs> Number three, why is there a constant rumble in the back? What isn't there? I can Number use. Two, <laughs> ask Mel Gibson to speak to Huang. And number one, watch twitch.tv slash slam jam. Oh my god, my game started. Oh my god. Okay, well, I could use these tips. Ah. Let me link that, though. If you guys want to see more of that, let me link it real quick. There's the link, guys. Go, go, go. Give, give him a view. Give him a follow. That's definitely some great content right there. It's from our boy Grathrang as well. I want to eat, though. I don't, I don't feel like playing right now. Ah. Oh god. That was good stuff. I like Mimi Khan like that. <clears throat> Definitely go check out that YouTube channel, guys. Alright. <laughs> yeah, I think number one was like watch Slam and do the opposite, because Slam always plays Wong. <laughs> I think Slam does generally pretty well against them, though. Alright, let's just do fast castle ourselves, basically. I'm gonna do the exact same build he does. Try to try to do it one pop faster for market. I mean there's multiple ways to stop a Huang Rush, guys. It's not it's not necessarily like if I have to play in a tournament, I don't think it's I I don't think I'll lose a single game to Huang. Um But in, in real games when you're just messing around doing Standard strategies, you can kind of get caught by it. And he also has messed up his builder with key. Yeah, like if I send two villagers now to his, to his base, he can, yeah, he can definitely take some, uh, some good damage. <sighs> I just try to do the same build he's doing. He's gonna do it just as, just as well, if not better. He practices a lot though. The danger part. Hey, yeah, Mirror pick Celts. Oh, we're picking Celts today, so if you read the title, you'll explain the whole thing. Playing. Oh my god. Oh my god. She went around the berries. Are you literally serious? You're so stupid, villager. Holy shit. You deserve to die, but I'm gonna save you because I'm trying to win this game. Huang, move your scout, dog. That's not very good for him. Alright. Why do you think Kelts are bad? Did I ever say Kelts are bad? Hey, I just wanted to let you know that I won five save games using your fast archers build. I thank you and Atomic Sausage for the gifted sub. Yo, the melon, that's awesome, man. That's awesome. Uh, keep it up, man. Using the builders is a great way to improve as well. Yo, chat, there's a lesson in you guys for that. Melon won five straight games in a row using the straight archer builder, and he probably has now not mastered it, but learned it to a decent level as well to pull it off consistently. Yo, what's up, Roxy? What's up? Welcome back. Uh, let me just thank Shimurai for the prime. Welcome to the stream. How's it going, Roxy? Playing some cult games today. Remember to host Voy on after stream. Yes, me- Oh! <clears throat> Nothing happened. 
Yes, I can definitely do that. No worries. Been wanting to host Voran for a long ass time, but I either forget or shit happens. Thanks for reminding me, Roxy. I'll send one over to him after the stream. We have two we have 2,369 subscribers, by the way. Why are Kelts your worst? Um yeah, so like why are Kelts are my worst civ? They're their strengths are kind of like forward siege aggression, like a lot of a lot based on map control, and that's simply not my strengths as a player. Not something I usually go for. So I'm playing them to try and improve the area and try to get their win rate up uh, a little bit. So that's kind of the idea here, but that's the reason why I'm not very good with Celts, I would say. Was Viper online today? Yeah, we we, we went three one against Viper. Oh, uh, one three, sorry, against Viper, uh, or something like that. So it was pretty bad games versus him. Well, I don't want to say bad games because losing doesn't mean a bad game, but it was. Pretty rough games for me, but I think it's still decent games overall. I got no loom on his ass. He lost the scouts. Alright, let's see if my improvised build is better than Huang's uptime now. Wish I had better deer, but hey. Oh my god, are you kidding me, dude? That militia I'm saying? Why would you rush after losing your scout? That makes no sense. So what I'm gonna do is hit it once now, so it resets it. I'm no loom, so I'm gonna have to defend this rush with quick walls. It'd be that hard, realistically. To go on that side. He's doing his infinite drush build that instead this time. Oh, I don't want to die. I should live. Can't really afford that farm. Are oh, my villagers are idle for some reason? Thank you, DE. Oh, I don't think he. I don't think he does a blacksmith. So I already messed up. He doesn't do a blacksmith. He does this market now. Back of this rush. I will, I will, I will push him now. I'm gonna literally Huang Huang right now. Oh man, I'm gonna Huang Huang. All right. <laughs> that is what I want to do right now. So he does forward stable as well. I'm improvising this completely, by the way. He does no eco bonus, no eco upgrades. Forward stable, we'll wall in our bills if need be. I don't think he does more farms, he sends everything to gold now as well. Wood and gold basically, he doesn't use a lot of food besides berries and shit. Yeah, they say two Huangs don't make it right, but I'm gonna show you that maybe it does in some cases. Market going down. Blacksmith. Gold. 
I'm surprised he doesn't get double bit axe. That doesn't make sense to me. I think you should get double bit axe even in a build like this. Make a couple spears as well. I heard those guys are pretty good. Put them inside the ram. <laughs> I think he knows what's coming here. <laughs> no, no, no. I, mean, you, you, I think you make a few villagers here. Just to start. <laughs> we don't make villagers? Okay, I'll make just two, it's fine. They pay back fast, they pay back fast stress. Mangano? No, ram first. Monastery now could be good. Ram first, then Mangano after that, I guess, or Scorpion maybe. We don't make villagers? I have to stop making villas. You both did more than two farms. Completely messed up build door. <laughs> Look how fast it kills buildings. Not natural, bro. I don't really want those actually. I think you have to balance these guys. What, what do my villagers do now besides maybe houses? We should make a play for the TC soon, right? That's how it works. He has a, he has a defensive Huang rush. He went pikeman actually. Ah, you're you're dead, <laughs> bro. The strategy is insane. I don't need any more of that. <laughs> oh, Kelt etc. Actually, what the hell, dude? We just have we have better micro than him inherently. How does it feel, Huang? How does it feel? <laughs> he knows what just happened. He knows. Count ETC, man. <laughs> he knows exactly what just happened right now. I used your own shit against you. He can't even defend it. <laughs> he doesn't know how. <laughs> he doesn't know how to defend it.
<laughs> no one knows actually. <laughs> oh god, yeah, it's Jack. Thanks for getting the set to the stream, man. Those watching on YouTube, because this is definitely going there. Oh man, make sure to make sure to show Huang some love. I'm gonna leave the link to his Twitch channel in the description, so you guys can go check him out there as well. And make sure to come on down to our Twitch channel as well. Link will be also in the description. GG Huang, though that was a lot of fun. Oh man, I made stuff for the last game where I got Huang. <laughs> Dude, it's such a strong strategy, actually. <laughs> Wait, what if I just do this every game? Should, should I just do this every game? Like, okay, how about this actually? I, I learned the build order, I keep it in my back pocket. I'm like, I'm like decent player, right? I play standard, but then when I want to pull it out, I just hog someone, like, out of nowhere. Like, I just, I just keep it in my back pocket. It, it, like, I, I have better micro than Huang, right? I have better micro than Huang, I have better APM than Huang. I can literally just take the strategy and do it better. Another 50 subs and Harry has to change his name to Hera Huang. <laughs> but yeah, actually I do that. I do that. 50 subs, 50 subs, and I change my name to Hera Huang. Like, for like, till the end of the year, actually, straight up. 